And yeah, as you guys can pretty much tell by the uh, by the title of this uh, video, yes, I do want to give my thoughts on WWE 2K20. I haven't played the game, no, and and I'm very very thankful that I haven't because of a few reasons. One, the fact that that it looks like garbage. Two, the graphics, honest to God, look like they're from the PS2 era. Three, and this probably should have been the first thing I mentioned, but I'll mention it now. Uh, the constant and irritating crashes. That's right. This game crashes so many times. Yeah, as I probably mentioned in that video I did this uh, this morning, which I don't know. I I did the video, yes, but when I did the video, well, let's just say I wasn't exactly you know being completely honest with you guys. I may have left out some details in that video. And if I did, I'm um, sorry about that. Um, yeah, I just thought, you know, maybe I'd, uh, you know, mention it to you guys. And, uh, <clears throat> and, uh, yes, 2K games, seriously, you need to fix your fucking shit. Is, because is this really all you've got? This is what you've got for a game. You brought out this game, and it's a fucking mess. This game is a, is a walking disaster area. This game sucks. I mean, this game, it sucks. It's just... A fucking pile of shit. I'm gonna... I, there, I said it. This game is a fucking pile of shit. I mean... Really? WWE... Really, 2K games? You're... Really going to treat this game... As if you didn't just throw it together in like... Three weeks. Let's see, graphics look like they're from the PS2 era. Fuck you, again that's strike one. And you basically... Um... All you did basically was, was throw together like... Was throw together this fucking mess. Yeah, that's literally what you did. You didn't throw, you didn't put this game together very well. I mean, yeah, take a look at what the take a look at what the superstars look like in this game, 2K16. Now, 2K games compare them to what you brought out in 2K20. And yes, guys, the hashtag fix WW2K20 is still trending on Twitter because people are still posting glitches that they're still having in WWE 2K20. I mean, is WWE, I mean, is 2K Games going to release the patch or not to fix this game? Like I said in that video that I made this morning, you guys. If, um, you know, anyone who bought this game, you know, basically, you know, I, I, what I meant to say is, Anyone who bought this game really should, you know, really... It, okay, guys, let's say after the patch is released, okay? And it, and it fixes nothing. Then here's what 2K Games should do for you. They should give you your money back and let you keep the game for and, and just say... Here, why don't you take the game 
for free. What we'll give you the game for free, and then we'll give you a coupon. So, you, so if you got, so if there's any other WWE games you want to purchase, you can do that. Okay. Introducing the challenger. I mean, really WWE, really. So let me get this straight. You released a game in 2015 called WWE 2K16, and it looks like this, what you're seeing on the screen right now. And then you release a game in 2019 today, October 22nd, 2019, called WWE 2K20, and it looks like absolute dog shit. And the graphics look like they're from the PS2 era. Really? And we're underway. Looking at these two men, really? Going to be anything traditional about this one -on -one matchup. I mean, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, WWE? Yeah. Really? What a beast Steve Austin has been so far in this match. I mean, Jesus. What the fuck? And yes, guys, as I said earlier, in case you didn't hear what I said earlier, no, I haven't played the game for myself, and thank God I never will. I just want to make a point to the, I just want to make a point right now. That, I mean, look at this game and compare it to the, okay. <clears throat> For those of you guys who have played the game, or know someone who has, or, or know someone who has the game, you know, if, again, if you play the game yourself, you know, you know, go ahead and share your thoughts on it. Go ahead and share what you think, what you think of the game. I think the game's in a fucking mess myself. Yeah. And, uh, well... What do I think of WWE 2K16? I think it's pretty good. What do I think of 2K20? It's an utter mess. First of all, the game fucking, the game fucking crashes like crazy. And I, again, I don't know if the day, I don't know if that day one patch has come, has come through, has come yet. And if it has, can anyone out there let me know who has the game? You know, has that really improved anything? Because if it hasn't, then 2K, then 2K Games needs to give you guys your money back. Because if this is, this if this is their best... If this is them at their best, if this is them doing, doing like, them claiming to do the minimum, the maximum amount of work, then I don't know what in the world they were talking about. Yeah. Because... This game, I swear to God, WWE 2K20 looks like it was thrown together in about three weeks. Oh yeah. The graphics look terrible. When you talk to people in, uh, in the, uh, uh, Whatever, whatever it is that you talk to people in, whatever part of, you know, career mode that is, guess what? The one thing that should be moving on their faces doesn't. This part of their face, the mouth, that part of it doesn't move. Not at all. <sighs> Okay. So. Okay, what's the next thing that sucks about 2K20? Um, well, the glitches, obviously. 
Oh my god. I mean, some of the glitches I've seen, be it, be it in YouTube videos or fucking on Twitter, I mean, this game is a... I mean, 2K20 is a fucking disaster. <sighs> this... This is the game that you made. 2K games. You made this hunk of pig... Sh you made this hunk of shit. And you expect people to pay... 60 bucks for this broken piece of shit this broken piece of ass no this this is bullshit this isn't happening no I mean okay guys now I understand you know that you know that yes it was that yes this game was released just today i understand that but you would think that the that the that the makers of the game 2k games i think it was would have done like oh i don't know maybe just the tiniest bit of work on the game you know, they would have maybe just possibly, you know, done just the slightest bit of research. And maybe done a little test, a little beta testing of this game. To see what was working and what wasn't. But did they? Nope. They didn't do a damn. They didn't do a damn bit. Not a bit, people. Not a bit. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh god. This, this game's been a fucking disaster. Yeah, I mean, literally, some, uh, literally, I have, I have never seen a game that literally makes me question, that would literally make me call into question, ever playing a game like that ever again. Oh wait, I haven't played it at all yet, so, yeah. Heading toward the ring with a no-nonsense look. That's for sure. I mean, guys, this game is a fucking bro. <laughs> Not this one. 2K20 is a broken fucking mess. It's a broken mess that really doesn't know what the hell it's. It really doesn't know what it's doing, and it doesn't really give, you know, to, and it doesn't really give a fuck about anything. I mean, Jesus. This is a one -on -one matchup, and I don't think I have to remind you know, what's on the line here. you know some of you guys? And they say that 2K20 is not, is not basically an updated version of 2K19? In what way is it not? Yes, I know the graphics, like I said, look like they're from the PS2 era. <sighs> what As a fuck? Okay. 2K games? What the fuck? You gotta release a, you gotta release the patch, man. You gotta. I mean, you have to do it. Because if you don't... Chances are people are not going are going to basically never play your games ever again. Yeah. People are going to say, you know what? 2K games? They don't know what the hell they're doing. 
and they're going to basically say, you know what? They don't. I mean, wow. I mean, look at what you did in, with with 2K16. Look. Stone Cold and Bret Hart look like Stone Cold and Bret Hart. They look like they're supposed to. 2K20, God only knows what kind of nonsense, what kind of nonsense you did, you did, you did to, you did to the, you did to them. I mean, God, God only knows. I mean, okay. Last man standing match. Nobody's leaving this ring. Two K games. Well, let me put it to you like this, okay? Let me put it to you like this, right? So, how in the hell are people supposed to get there? Are how the hell are people supposed to play the game? If, first of all, they can't even get past the first hour of the game, as I can, as I clearly explained, in, as I may not have explained as clearly as I should have in the video I made this morning, but it was a, but let's just say, guys, I had just seen a stream of WWE 2K20 from someone who apparently had just gotten the game, and, uh, well... Yeah, even he agrees this game this game is a fucking broken that 2K20 is a broken fucking mess. It's a I mean 2K20 I have literally no other words to say except Are you kidding? This this is how you basically are trying to save your reputation. WWE, this is how you're saving your reputation by making a game that is that is so poorly done that was so poorly done and literally doesn't work right. And, my God. I mean, Jesus. Folks, we're in Rosemont tonight, a city that has hosted several WrestleManias, including the second leg of WrestleMania 2. I mean, 2K games, you gotta know. That you done fucked it. You done. You done fucked it up. Seriously, I have never seen a WWE game done so piss poorly since Steel Cage Challenge on the NES. Yeah. I have never seen a game done that bad. Steel Cage Challenge was terrible. Of course, King of the Ring wasn't wasn't any better. No, I have not seen a WWE game done so badly as since King of the Ring. Since King of the Ring in ninety. 93 I think and you literally put out you literally you literally just didn't didn't even put forth a goddamn effort this I literally cannot come up with the correct words to say here. Except, is this for fu Are you for fucking real? Are you for real right now? Or 
were you as I suspected, as I have suspected, getting pretty close to closing your doors? Otherwise, there is no re there is no certifiable reason why you should have released this game as as soon as you did. You should have waited until about say I don't know December to release this game. You should have waited until January, until December or January. To release this game. Maybe you could have released it in February of next year. In 2020. This game, I swear to God, is just a fucking disaster. I'm sorry, guys, but. This had this this rant had to be done. Look, I know this rant is pointless, and it may be pointless to you guys, but it's not pointless to me. This is a rant I feel needs to be done because basically, WWE 2K games, WWE and 2K games need to realize the need to realize what they've done oh and uh, WWE don't think I'm gonna let you off the hook for that tweet basically you sent out from the at WWE on Fox Twitter account which you deleted by the way really you basically want the fans to stop saying what gee and you said it's not 2001 anymore. Gee, could that have anything to do with the fact that the fans are sick of this bullshit? This is what every competitor dreams of. The fans are tired of it. We've had it. We've had it. WWE, we're done. We're done listening to your bullshit. I mean, are you fucking nuts? Have you lost your marbles? Oh my god. I mean, yeah, I, I understand, you know, if... Look, I understand, you know, if that was, you know, if you guys had put forth some effort, but no, no, that was you literally sitting on your asses for basically about, about, uh, maybe for about like, From the time when you announced this game to basically its release date, which was today. Yeah. Jesus. Oh my god, this game is so bad. I mean, I have just, honest to God, ne I've never seen a game that requires, that literally needs to be put in the hands of someone competent. Or a game that never should have been made in the first place. This game never should have been made. This game is a fucking, this game's a joke. This has to be a joke, because this is the game you literally brought out. Today. And again, guys, I'm gonna say this one more time. And I don't know, I don't know, I don't know if I really should, I don't know if I should even say it again. But seriously, it seriously, 2K games, go ahead and patch 2K20. 
and then people see if the game's still acting up, see if the game still still doesn't work, see if the glitches still happen and shit. I don't fucking know. I don't know. If the if the glitches don't happen anymore, then then the pa then that patch was needed. Oh wait, what am I saying? The patch is needed regardless. And uh well yeah. What the heck, man? Oh God! Oh my God! This I, I have literally never seen a game that sucks so bad like this one does. I mean, literally, I've never seen a game that has so that has so much go that has that had potential. And that potential has been fucking squandered. Because of the idiots who made it. Because of the idiots who made it. It's like... Nothing in the game looks right. The game doesn't hardly work anymore. Doesn't hardly work. I mean... What the fuck? Oh my god. What's the worst that can happen? A loss? Who cares? It's not like the title of oh Clearly motivated by what's inside that briefcase, Michael. This game, I swear to God, is just driving me nuts. This game is gonna... I swear to God, this, this is gonna be on my mind all night. This game is just gonna be on my mind all freaking night. Oh my god. This game is just fucking, is a fucking mess. Oh, son of a bitch. You got it. I mean... Is this seriously, you know, what WWE thinks of their customers nowadays? Apparently. This is apparently what WWE thinks of us nowadays. Yeah. They don't care. No, they don't. Yes. Okay. Question. Question time. So where does the blame fall? Does the blame fall on the player, on the people who bought the game? Not at all. Does the blame fall on 2K Games? Yes. Does the blame fall on WWE? Yes. Does the blame fall on people who paid full price for this game? No. Not at all. <sighs> I mean, what do you guys think? I mean, do you guys think, you know, that this game really, really needs, you know, really needs to, um, you know, do, do you think that people deserve a refund for this, for this broken mess? Yeah, if you guys do, let, feel free to let me know, because that's my thoughts about it. Yeah. If you guys think this game sucks, give me a hell yeah. This game is a dis this game is a is a is a disaster. 
This game is a mess. This game sucks. I mean, this this is not what a WWE game is supposed to look like. Okay, it's not supposed to look like a PS like a game from the PS2 era. And really, yeah. And this is pretty much what you come up with. Oh my god, this game, this game just fucking sucks. Hang on, guys. There you go. <sighs> I mean, you know, guys. If I had to. If I had to make a guess as to why this game sucks as hard as it does, couldn't tell you. I really couldn't tell you. And basically, oh yeah, and uh, they make the guy apparently a bumbling, a complete fucking idiot where they make the girl completely competent does anybody else see a problem there I do I see a problem there because shouldn't they both be competent you know instead of one being a complete idiot and the other one being you know kind of smart really really kind of smart and really, and again, let me reiterate a point I made in that vi I made in that video I made this morning. Okay, guys. Okay, one of the times the game crashes during career mode is if you change one of the is if you change the the superstars is if you change the one of the characters that you're playing as in the career mode. If you, is if you change their look, the game will just crash. What the hell? I, I, I'm sorry, you guys, but how does how did W how did two K games? get away with this how did they get away with this shit no really how'd they get away with this shit This, this is terrible. To you 2K games, I've only this to say. Yeah, that's right. I've only this to say. Fuck you. You done fucked it up. You done screwed it up. Release the damn patch. And see what happens. And really, oh my God. how does this game, how is this a $60 retail AAA game when, first of all, it's not really even that good? It's basically pretty much this, it's almost exactly the same thing as like, it's almost a carbon copy cut out of 2K19. I mean, really? This, 
<sighs> yeah. I mean, guys, this is... The, guys, I really don't know what else to say here except... <sighs> 2K Games, either fix this game or you just need to go out of business, okay? One or the other, because honestly, guys, this this is getting this is getting ridiculous, you know. And now, let's just you know go ahead and you know do another do another match. Oh my god, this game is just a fucking disaster. I have never, I've never seen a game that is released in such condition, in such a condition as this one was. I have never in my life seen a game that sh that should have been released. In it should have been released in in a great condition, but instead it was released in literally a broken in broken condition because the game. Oh my god! Yes, guys, I know I'm using an older game as you know, but as my as you know my. Um, you know, it's basically my way of proving something, but, uh, well, let's just say I wanted to show you guys what 2K20 should have just been. It should have just been, you know, something like this, where, you know, and yes, the showcase mode for 2K20, oh, the four horsewomen? No. No, 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 no. That stable doesn't exist as far as I'm concerned. It's the four horsemen. Not horsewomen. That's stupid. Really? They're going to become worthless? Not even worth... Not even... They're not even going to be playable anymore. And I guess, basically, you know, I guess the only people who can play them are people who actually, you know, don't want, who actually don't want to play them, and even don't want to play them, I guess, because it's like, yeah. So the four horsewomen are the t are the two K show showcase mode. Why? That stable didn't go anywhere. That stable was a damn joke. Was a joke. Just like the fucking idiots. Just like the four useless idiots. Who made who made up the members of the four of the four horse women? I'm sorry, but it'll always be the four horsemen. Ric Flair, Arn Anderson, and whatever other whatever members were members of the horsemen. A win tonight is huge. I mean, just think about this. The title's not on the line, but the momentum you're riding after a win like that is huge. And this is how you basically want people to remember this game, 2K20. This is how you want this game to be remembered as one of the most glitchy pieces of shit that has ever truly existed. This is WWE 2K20. Yeah. Absolutely anything can this 
No, this isn't 2K20. I don't have 2K20. And let's just say I'm very thankful that I don't have it. And guys, yes, I'm doing this as a as a PSA, as a public service announcement. So that that way you guys don't spend your six your sixty dollars on that glitchy piece of shit. Now, if you want to now if you want to put your money in a game, here's a game I do recommend if you guys want to. I'm not saying you have to. Invest your money in Ghostbusters the Game Remastered, which is basically the game from 2009, you know, just remastered. Yeah, the one, that, the Ghostbusters game that's actually good. Yeah. This game fucking sucks. Why do I keep saying that this game sucks? This game doesn't suck. No. This game is actually pretty good. 2K20, on the other hand, can go rotten hell. Yeah. This is really what, you know... I mean, I have... N I, yes. Actually, guys, there's only one other game that I've ever seen that literally was, you know, has been this hated. And boy, oh boy, do we all know it's what I'm talking about. I'm not even going to mention its name. Because I think we all know which game I'm talking about. This game is, this game is a fucking mess. Oh my god. And by the way, guys, I'm going to clarify it right now. When I say this game, I mean 2K20. I'm not talking about this game. No, 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 no. This game might have, you know, it's notable, it's, it's kind of notable problems. But at least this game actually, you know, at least you can actually play it. Whereas 2K20? No. You can't. Ladies and gentlemen, it doesn't get any bigger than this. A match under the bright lights of WrestleMania. Yeah. Wow. He's still down after that. <sighs> yeah. Another amazing singles contest. These two never see However, guys. The WWE universe. If I, if I have to be on, if I can be honest for a moment here, well, again, guys, I'm again, guys, I'm doing this as a public service announcement, so that that way you don't have, so you don't have to go through this, so that that way you guys don't have to go through this mess. So that that way you guys can actually avoid avoid spending your harder money on a game that a doesn't a is broken is broken as all hell <sighs> and b well people have been wanting to see these is it really worth a damn to be honest with you i think they're getting what they wanted to be honest with you this game it this game yes this game is this game has its moments here and there where it's kind of acting up a little but but hey at least this one actually again you know is working properly so again guys yes this may not this may not sound like a public service announcement but i swear to you that's why i'm do, that's why i'm doing this that's what i'm doing that stuff for, that's what i'm trying to do this as a public service announcement Trying to basically say, you guys, don't spend your money on this game. Maybe then it'll teach 2K games and WWE that we're not going to talk, that we're not going to tolerate shit like this anymore. That we're not going to take this shit anymore. 
that what we want in our games is a good game. That we've had enough. Oh yeah. So basically, one, two. All right. Again, guys, that's why I'm doing this. I'm doing this as a PSA for you guys to warn you guys: stay away from this game altogether. Oh yeah. However, well, yeah, I'd say basically, if you're going to invest 60 bucks in something, I don't know, like, maybe you could invest that 60 bucks into buying a good game or something like that, you know. Yeah, you could do that. If that's what you want to do. Yeah. <sighs> and again, guys, if you have any memories of this game, or if you want to share your thoughts on it, you know, go ahead and go ahead and do so. Because, <clears throat> well, <sighs> I mean. This is a mess. This game is a fuck. This game is another mess. I mean, this this isn't what I had in mind when I said when I said that basically what we want is a WWE product that doesn't suck. This isn't what I... This isn't what we all meant. The WWE product in a video game should not be an outward reflection of the current product as is. I mean... Wow. You know... Wow. I mean, yeah. Yeah. I mean, Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, I got nothing. I really honestly don't see how I don't see how patching this patching this game is even gonna make any difference, to tell you the truth. To tell you the truth, I don't think it is. I don't think it's gonna make any I don't think it's gonna make any difference whatsoever. No, I really don't. Because, well, I mean, I, I hate to admit it, guys, but this game, it's another train wreck. It was a train wreck then, and it's a train wreck now, and it's going to remain a train wreck until such time as basically they fix it. Yeah. It's terrible. And basically stay away from this game. Don't invest your money in it. Ever. If anyone out there is, if anybody out there is watching, you know, 
Gwen, feel free to chime in with your thoughts on on this on this mess because, well, you guys you guys deserve to be heard. Cause you know if you guys are never heard, well, then that's not good. Yeah, you guys deserve to be heard from. If not, if not, if not from me, then you guys deserve to be heard from some other way. You know? I mean, I, I have just never seen something done so, so bad. If if I had to, I mean literally, if someone gave if someone gave me a choice between playing 2K20 or watching like or watching the most boring movie of all time, I'd say boring movie, please. That's right. I'd rather watch a boring movie than than play 2K20. Oh my god. I'd, mu I'd much rather watch what's the most boring TV show of all time than, than play 2K20. I mean... Oh my god. It's like... Okay. You guys know what WWE... What 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 games look like on the PS2, right? What the wrestlers look like in PS2 games? Well, that's pretty much what they look like in WWE 20. In WWE 2K20. Because, literally, you're... It's like their... It's like their face... It's like their... It's like they didn't even try... I mean, did 2K20 even, you know, you know, pre, you know, test this game out before they released it? No. Did they even, did they even fucking, you know, look at it before they released it? No. They just shipped it out and said, fuck it. That's right. They literally shipped it out and just said, fuck it. Oh my god. It's like, even Becky Lynch, as much as I hate her guts, even she looks terrible in this game. Oh my god. I am starting to wonder was was whoever wrote this was whoever wrote the story of this game like did they know nothing about about the about you know professional wrestling at all because because in career mode in the career mode as far as I know <sighs> okay answer me this was Jake the Snake Roberts ever trained at the at the Hart Family Dungeon in Stu Hart's Dungeon? I don't think so. First of all, Jake the Snake Roberts was from Georgia. The Hart the Stu Hart's Dungeon is in Canada. So, you tell me how that could possibly be true. Exactly. This... This sucks. I mean, literally, whoever wrote this script... I swear to God, must have been, e must have been either high or... or... drunk. 
or not even know what the fuck they were talking about. Yeah, Bret Hart I can understand, because Bret Hart was Stu Hart's son. Jake Roberts? I'm sorry, but Jake Roberts live, lives in Stone Mountain, Georgia. Not in Can- He doesn't live in Canada. Really? Booker T looking to add to his already impressive legacy here tonight. Hey, he's already in the Hall of Fame. What else does Booker want? And... This should be amazing. Roddy Roddy Piper... Hot Rod lives in lives in lives in Oregon. He does not live in Cat. I don't think he was trained in in Stu Hart's dungeon in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Damn it! And it turns out that basically the two losers literally want to become professional wrestlers really it's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time i honestly have no idea who wrote this garbage? Who wrote this garbage dialogue? I mean, Jesus. I mean, yeah, remember, remember when you guys were in high school and it was lunchtime and you were thinking, oh yeah, why don't we try to become WWE superstars? Really? No. No, 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 no. That's a dream that maybe you could do later in life. But not, but not in high school, you dumb skulls. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. One of the most impressive things about Booker T's axe kick is you can actually see your oh, opponent's face God. crash to the canvas after being hit with it. I, that's when you know a superstar is I, 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 powerful. Yeah. Something that most I people can't. forget until it's too late. I just can't grab, can grasp out of nowhere. Oh, this not taking an story. With the axe kick. He's crushing this story him. has basically <laughs> nothing to do with anything. And this story and literally, exact, I swear to God, must have been written by like a five-year-old or a fifth grader. Because the story makes makes little to no sense. Has to nothing to do with here. anything. Yeah, and the and Black drop. <sighs> if I had to pick what kind of what kind of dialogue they were, what kind of person came up with half this crap? I think someone who's never watched professional wrestling in their lives. Yeah. Because literally that's about as good an estimation as I can come up with. Yeah. Yeah, because, I don't know, like, maybe I'm, maybe I'm missing something here. He's in full-on attack mode now. And, look out, look out, this could be it. What? Looks like another check in the oh, see, there I said it. Yes, a ring technician, however. And, 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 and WWE on Fox wants Pete wants the fans to stop saying that. And there's the count. Give me one good reason why. And the rest starts to count. Because it's not 2001. 
Oh, gee, I didn't realize that basically the fans had to sit there and say what and do nothing. Because that's literally how a company... That's what happens when a company is ran by it is ran by someone who doesn't know what they're doing anymore. That's a good thing. Jesus. This is what happens when you let an idiot run the world. He gets the tag. Get your, get your scraggly ass up, motherfucker. I know you're behind this. I know you're behind what's going on here. So, Vince, admit it, okay? Just admit it right here, right now. I want to hear you say it. I'm Vince McMahon. Admit to being a failure as a CE, as the CEO, as the chairman of WWE. And Vince, do you realize that all of WWE's problems could be solved if you would just leave? Seriously, all of all of its problems could be solved if you would just leave. And WWE 2K20? Yeah, it just, need, it, just, it just needs to go in the trash. No. It does. It really, really does. It just needs not to exist anymore. Really, really, really. <laughs> yeah, Zack Ryder, I don't think so. You blew, you blow it, and you blew it, kid. You blew it, kid. You you call your you dare to call yourself a le a superstar? You ain't no superstar, man. You're nothing. Your career was a waste. And so was WWE 2K and so was WWE 2K20. Yeah. Because really, you're gonna make the guy in 2K in the career mode a complete bubbling num a complete bubbling numb nuts. But you're gonna make the girl competent. I'm sorry, but what? You know, shouldn't like the story be competent and everyone involved be, you know, competent? You know? No, 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 no. We can't have that. Can't have that. We have to make sure that women, that basically only women are competent. We have to basically make sure that women, and only women are competent. Not the guys, oh no. We have to make sure they're complete bubbling fuck nuts. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. One, two, thank you. You see, guys? That right there is what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, that's another thing in 2K20 that really that really pisses me off. Like, for example, the, you know the referee sometimes takes a little while to get in position in the correct position. Well, imagine if you're in the if you're in the pinning position if he's if. What I mean is, imagine if you're pinning your opponent like I'm about to do right now, and the referee just stands there and does and does exactly fuck all. That's right. The referee getting involved now. Really? Now. 
No, for your, no, for your sorry ass. No, for your ass. Bitch. Yes. All right, Vince. Get your, get your, get your, get your ass in here. I ain't dealing with you yet, bitch. No, hell no. I ain't dealing with you, motherfucker. Time to go with the pin. One, two, fuck you. Cena's fuck off. Let's try small package. One, two, three. I told you guys. I told you. Now, Cena, let's see if you're as much of a superman as you think, as, as WWE builds you up to be. Or are you just the, or are you just the pussy ass bitch that I've always known you actually are? And that I've always known that you aren't worth it, that you weren't worth a damn, and you never will be. It'll be interesting to see who becomes the alpha male early in the contest. Yeah, the fight is on for dominance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, guys, I know. But see, guys, the reason why, the reason why, again, I'm only doing this, guys, to, you know, I'm doing this basically for your own good. I'm basically telling you guys... 2K20? No. No, don't waste your money there. Now, if you want to spend your money on on something good, you know, maybe you could, I don't know, maybe track down and track down like, uh, you know, copy of some like good wrestling events or something like that. If you really want to, you know, if you want basically... If you want to watch something good. And he goes for the pin. There's the count. One, two. Oh, now, now we're starting to see Super Cena. As I said, Cena, you're a bitch. You're a bitch. And what I t what did I say? Loser. So, guys, as far as WWE tw WWE 2K20 goes, I have just this to say. Fuck you, fuck you 2K games fuck you WWE patch this fucking game and if you cannot then give people their money back or better yet give them something for free to make up for the mistake you make for the fuck up you did because that's what you've done yet I fucked it up so, a is the only way to this so, question now remains, who's at fault here? I asked that question earlier, and I don't, and I still don't know the answer to that question. Who's when truly at fault at here? Who do we blame for this mess? The developer, 2K Games, maybe. WWE, most likely. The fans who, the people who bought the game, not at all. I don't blame them one bit. Here no. Winners, T, Macho Man I mean, if you guys are going to blame anyone... 2K games would be would be mo my most would be the most likely bet. 
Oh yeah, and here's another thing. Here's another thing that really kind of really kind of gets me irritated about 2K20. All the fucking glitches and shit. Like for example, when your wrestler is in the ring and they're still doing their entrance, all of a sudden the lights go out in the arena. What the fuck? So yeah, what the fuck? I mean, really, 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 w, really, two K games, really, really. You really couldn't have possibly put any better thought into this. This. This is really your best. This is your best. This, this is a joke, right? Because this, this is this is no this is no joke. No, it's not anymore. So, guys. Why don't you guys go ahead and, uh, you know, sound off in the comments section down below, or tell me what you guys think, and tell me what you guys, what you guys think, if you guys have ever played this, played this piece, played this miserable piece of shit, play this miserable pile of shit, or if you know anyone who has, you know, go ahead and sound off for them, you know, it's the only way, you know, it's the only way, the only way 2K Games is ever going to learn anything is if is if basically people just fi people finally reveal people finally reveal 2K Games for the complete liars they truly are nowadays. So guys, I think it's about time to end it here. And uh, yeah, I want to thank you guys for uh, watching and. Um, you know, if you guys, you know, f do feel so obliged to, um, you know, to let me know what you guys thought about it. You guys can, uh, you know, let me know on Twitter if you guys want to. That's really up to you, really. And, uh, wow. I have never seen a game that was, that was basically released in such a busted condition and oh my god yeah guys I, guys I just wanted I just wanted to you know thank you guys for watching and um you know do feel free if you guys have any you know further questions you got I mean if you guys have any comments about the video or or if uh, you guys want to you know, want to ask me anything, you know, you can always uh, ask me on Twitter if you guys want to. Yeah, that's really up to you. Yeah, um, <sighs> um, so guys, until um, next time, remember, I love you all very much. You guys take care. You guys be you guys be safe out there, and and if the cold and remember guys, if you guys live in the northern hemisphere, the cold weather's coming. Nothing we can do about it. Just brace yourselves for it. And if you can't, and if you have to, stay in, stay inside. If you don't, if you don't have to go outside, don't. All right. So guys, remember, <sighs> like, comment, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and share this video around, and turn on notifications. And the reason why I'm asking you guys to share this video around is because, well, we all know that YouTube doesn't really, doesn't really give a doesn't give a fuck doesn't give a rat doesn't give a fucking rat's ass about us anymore because well 
yeah, we pretty much, you know, don't matter to YouTube anymore. And, you know, guys, honest to God, I'm really starting to wonder if, if, if I should even stay on this site anymore because this site is just, you know, just been a fucking disaster. And no, guys, if you're if you're if you're gonna ask, no, it's not you guys. You guys had nothing to do with this. I mean, you guys. I mean, guys, I gotta be honest with you guys, and I have every intention of being honest with you guys. It's not you guys at all. I mean, it's just... It's just a fucking mess. This... This site has just been a fucking disaster... From day one. Yeah, this site has just been a fucking disaster from day one. Especially day one of when you know who... And I won't say her name basically took over as CEO. I won't say her name because that name just gets on my nerves. <sighs> I mean, guys, I love you all very much. And guys, listen, if you guys don't get any new, if, listen, if I don't make any, any videos for a while, you guys will hopefully understand why, because, well, guys, I, to be honest with you, I have just about had enough of, you know, this whole fucking site. I just about had it with it, because, well, it, it just really doesn't have anything left for guy for people like me anymore. Because it doesn't want, because it doesn't value, you know, it doesn't see me as a, you know, valuable content creator anymore. And, well, guys, again, that's why I say I love you guys, that's why, that's why I, that's why I say, in the, at the, that's why I try and say in every video that I love you guys, that I love you all very much, and I want you guys to be safe out there. No matter where you, no matter where you're watching this from, it matters not. I mean, it, it doesn't matter if you guys are watching this like in Germany or Europe or Japan or wherever you're watching this from. Wherever you're watching this from, that's fine. That's cool. But I want you guys to be safe out there, okay? I just, God, I just want this, fuck, this is just not, you know, oh my God, I mean, you guys, I mean, you guys have given, I mean, with, I mean, guys, you know, all the views, every single view that you guys give me and, you know, like, I appreciate every one of them. Yes, I do. But sometimes people vote, people vote dislikes on my videos, and I just frankly have just really had enough of it. And that's another reason why I'm seriously considering not making videos much anymore, because, well, I'm sick and tired of people just voting dislikes on my videos, you know? I mean, I'm pretty sure that's happened to, you know, all of you guys out there. And, well, to be perfectly honest, this, this is, well, one of those times when I just realized, you know, maybe one, maybe one of these things needs to happen. Either I need to, either I need to stop doing videos altogether, or I just need to work with one of you guys. You know, I just need to co-opt on a vi on a video with you with you guys. You know, 
but guys, yes, yes, like I, like I said, like I said, like the title of the video says, WWE 2K20, it just fucking sucks, plain and simple. Do not, do not spend your money on this game, guys. Whatever, and guys, I'm gonna say this right, and and one of you guys are about to ask, and if one of you guys ask me in the future, would I even recommend this game as a rental? The answer is no. Okay, I'm gonna say this right here. Right now. There would only be one way that I would ever buy this game. And I mean one. One way. One way only. And hear me out. The only way I would ever buy this buy this fucking game is if is if the price dropped to Fifteen, I mean ten to fifteen dollars. That's it. That would be the only way that I would ever actually consider buying this buying this fucking game. No, not the price drop ten to fifteen dollars. I mean if the price of the game literally dropped to ten to fifteen dollars. If a sticker price on the game said. Ten, anywhere from ten to fifteen dollars, I might consider it. But as it is right now, as it's priced right now, forget it. And if you got, and by the way, guys, if the video, if I mean, if the game has been patched and literally it's still acting up. Yeah, I don't know what the heck to tell you then. All I can tell you guys right now is, um, you know, just, uh, you know, hang in there. Just hang in there because, well, hopefully that, hopefully that patch is coming, hopefully. At least it better be. And, well... Well, when it comes, hopefully the game will actually work correctly. Hopefully it'll fix. Hopefully it'll fix the problems that you got. Whatever, whatever problem it is you guys are having with the game right now. Well, and uh, if you guys, you know, if, you know, if you guys have, if you guys have played the game, or if you know a friend who has, I. Again, I feel sorry for. Again, I feel sorry for everyone out there who has played this played this game right now. You know, in the broken condition that it's in. All I can say, guys, is I'm sorry, guys. So, guys, till next time. Remember, you guys are awesome. Keep being yourselves, keep doing what you're doing, and have a good night, or a good day, or whatever time, whatever time it is for you guys.